Hey, hey, this is Shiny Chaos, and we're back. Uh, apologize for the, uh, the abrupt transli er, transition, um, but, eh, yeah, I'm kind of new to this whole style, so didn't really realize the, uh, the video would cut off the uh, entirety of the ending. There was a bit more after the end, but nothing too important. Mostly just uh, a continued explanation on why you don't get hit by a uh, Gypsorosis Peck. Which is because it steals things from you and you can't get them back. Unlike the, uh, the cats, there's no place to dig the, your stolen items back up. Uh, and unlike the cats, Felvine doesn't do jack, so he will take anything and everything. Um, consumables are, pre are preferred over uh, everything else when the uh, algorithm goes to decide what to steal. And I have terrible aim. Um, but this is actually one of my favorite areas to fight Gypsaros in wide open um, very little poison ground uh, it's at the very edges of where you were lo where I was looking straight at before um, there's a couple pools of poison but other than that there's very little environmental danger um, so you have a very wide open space which suits a gunner a lot more because you don't have to worry about being caught up in any trees or anything like that um, which in the next video you'll see that that happened a couple times. Um, and yeah, this is what I was talking about. Completely vulnerable. I can get a good three or four shots, except I piss them off, and then I forget that I don't have any more bullets in the chamber. So I have that little click click. So I get a free reload because he doesn't have a crystal and he can't flash. Um, Rage mode gypsos. He is a lot faster. A lot faster. Um, the pecs come out very fast, very rapidly. You can no longer shoot between them if you don't want to get hit, if you have a uh, slow firing gun. Um, the poison is a bit more accurate. It, if you'll notice, that is really dangerous if you're melee. Um, see, a little bit environmental. One, two pools, but nothing too serious. And the pool poison doesn't really do that much damage. Um, you'll see me heal it up in a couple seconds. Uh, the poison shots will occasionally be the wrong uh, distance, I guess I would say. Um, so they'll be aimed right at you, but they're not going to hit you because they're too short or too long. Um, yeah, I'm shooting neck here. Uh, I can't really aim very fast with a gun yet, still, so uh, the neck was easier to get to where I could fire all three shots instead of taking maybe one shot at the head. Uh, especially since the head is a target that moves a lot more, but you do want to aim the head. Um, I haven't seen the hit charts recently, but I'm pretty sure Gypsaros's head just like Kakua's. Yeah, see that's why I was aiming for Knack. I mean, I, I miss the head enough. When he starts raging all the time, uh, oh, chicken run. Um, he is probably close to dead, uh, especially if you just see an immediate chicken run right after. Um, Chicken runs are... they're fun. Uh, <laughs> he, uh, he has a couple patterns with them. Um, if he's not ready to leave an area, uh, he will chicken run to leave an area. You'll see him run to a corner and he'll fly out after he chicken runs, but um, if he's not ready to leave the area, he will chicken run in a triangle. Um, doesn't care where you are, he doesn't aim at you or anything like that. He just runs in a triangle. Um, but, and spewing poison the entire way as a melee, it is retardedly a time waster because it, you can't really do much damage during it. I mean, he, he doesn't track you, so he doesn't follow you. Um, you can't really get close because he's charging throughout the entire thing and he's spewing poison to the left and the right. Um, and it, it just wastes your time quite a bit. And we're back in the area I don't like. Uh, yeah, see? This is what I'm talking about. It's a triangle run. Um, and he's not even charging me. He's not even paying attention to me. I'm paying a bit too much attention to Prey, unfortunately. Uh, after it, if he's going to redo it, he'll fly back to the starting spot. It's, well, right there in this area. It's the, there's only one starting spot in each area. Uh, and he charges away, charges to the right or the left, and then charges right back. And it's a pain. It wastes time. I 
it's one of the few things about one of the few things in the game that I just dislike because it doesn't do anything. <laughs> you you rarely will get caught with it. You only get caught with him when you don't notice that he's you know aimed directly at you. Um, and we've switched to our second song. So he's weak. He's limping. Um, he goes into I don't know the number of the area, but it's the area he first appeared uh, back in the first video. Uh, and goes to sleep. Um, do believe in this one. I, I don't kill him off the sleep immediately. I uh, I hit him once. He plays dead, and then I just start piercing through him. Uh, and he plays dead a couple times. Um, the play dead. <laughs> if you're a gunner, it's an instant kill. Um, don't get hit by it. If you're a gunner, there's no reason to get hit by it. Um, you can get carves off him when he plays dead if you have high speed gather otherwise you're going to carve and then die as he pops back up <laughs> um, let's see yeah uh, so if you want those extra carves feel free but uh, bring high speed gather and bring a shield cause you're alright if you can uh, high speed gather and then just shield block the hit because you can block it um, but you do that as Malie, uh if you want the carve so you can do it without high speed gather occasionally if you uh, if you have a shield and pray ruin my day again <laughs> respawning pray go uh, if you shoot him when he's playing dead or hit him I should say he tends to drop shinies uh, he doesn't do it more than once I don't believe um, at least not when there's another shiny out, and so I just shoot pel or pierces up his butt, and it eventually kills him. So you can get wyvern tears. Uh, I think I've gotten a light crystal out of it before. I don't get much good on the carves, just a a rubber hide and all that jazz. But uh, just some rubber hides, but. I'm running out of time, so this has been Shiny Chaos, and I will see you next time with a purple Gypsaros, and there's not terribly much difference aside from scenery. Alright, later!